To perform the individual manual muscle test for flexor carpi radialis, the patient is seated at a table. The forearm is resting at the table with the wrist off the edge of the table, positioned in almost full supination, but not quite full supination, with the wrist in a position of radial deviation and flexion. Up like that. Support the dorsal distal forearm uh, underneath. There we go, up like that is what we want. And resistance is applied to the second metacarpal head, basically straight down or in a direction of wrist extension and wrist ulnar deviation, which put together brings us straight down. I want you to hold it right there. Don't let me move it. Okay? Hold, 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 hold. Very good. Substitution would include finger flexion, thumb flexion, or thumb abduction would all be substitutions for flexor carpi radialis. Flexor carpi radialis is palpated at the wrist. Right here, you can see the tendon is very prominent. The tendon is just radial to the tendon for palmaris longus, which in this subject is not very prominent. 